All golfers have a hope to get better, but you need more than hope. You need a plan. And this video outlines your score improvement plan. The On Target Game Improvement System first develops a scoring profile to determine those areas of your game contributing the most to your high scores. This is done by tracking the shots you hit on the course in four areas, driving, approach shots, short game shots from around the green, and your putting. Golf is four games in one, and your scoring profile objectively measures and compares your skill scores in those four games and identifies your strengths and weaknesses. First, let's look at your driving performance in both distance and accuracy. The distance you hit with your best drives is good enough to score well. You don't necessarily need to hit your best drive better, just more often. Steve, during the round, you hit 50% of the fairways, but we were playing in very windy conditions, and you were working on a new movement of keeping your left foot down. You hit many good drives, and of course, you missed some as well. Your statistical goal for driving is to hit 60% of the fairways. Now let's look at your approach shot performance. During the round, we hit approach shots only from the fairway and par 3 tee boxes, and the majority of shots were from 150 yards or closer. You only hit 40% of the greens, but we were playing in extremely windy conditions. I recommend that you track the approach shots you play from the fairway and from a distance between 100 and 150 yards, and set a goal to hit 60% of the greens. One of the benefits of attending the school is you received a one-year membership to the On-Target Golf Association, which gives you access to PowerTracker, which makes keeping these statistics very easy. Now let's look at your performance from around the green. Golf is about hitting targets. While driving, your target is the fairway, and with approach shots, the target is the green. Your target for chip and pitch shots is to hit it close enough to give yourself a reasonable chance to make the first putt. During the round, you hit 75% of your short game shots inside of 18 feet and 62% inside of 9 feet. That is very good. Now, because these shots were always from good lies, and in real golf that won't always be the case, I want your statistical goal to have 60% of all your short game shots inside of 9 feet. During your 9-hole round, you had 4 3-putts, which is about once every 2 holes. On tour, the pros... 3-putt once every 30 holes. Also, for all the first putts you hit from further than 18 feet, only 13% stopped within 3 feet of the hole. I recommend your statistical goal for putting is to track the performance of all your first putts that are further than 18 feet from the hole and have 50% of them stop within 1 yard of the hole. Keeping this statistic is easy when using Power Tracker. Next in the on-target system is to prioritize the most important areas to work on first. I gave you statistical goals in each area, but what statistical goals are the most important to reach? I want my students to have one full swing project and one short game project. Your full swing project is to begin tracking how many fairways you hit with the driver, and your goal is to have a five round average of hitting 50% of the fairways. Your short game project is to improve your speed control for long putts. Your goal is to have a five round average of 60% of all first putts longer than 18 feet stop less than one yard from the hole. Once these goals are met, we can look again at your overall statistics and set new goals and projects. Now we have identified the problem areas and have set some statistical goals to achieve. Now we need to identify what's causing our current problem and implement corrections. To hit more fairways, you need to make the mechanical changes I described in your full swing report. This will require at least one session to establish the change and learn the drills to do your, in your practice session. You will probably need a follow up a few weeks after that to make sure you're still on track. During both the first session and any follow up sessions, I want also to work on your short game project. This work will be to continue the fundamentals we covered in the school on your short game. Part of the on-target system is to continue tracking your statistics when you play a round of golf. By attending the school, you now have a one-year membership to the On-Target Golf Association website, which has my power tracker, where you can easily record your statistics. The member side of the website is in the final stages of our newest update and will be ready to use shortly. When it is, I will send you your login information and the tutorials that show you how to use power tracker. The email I am sending will show you several options to choose from on which lesson program might best fit your situation. 